Hello guys, welcome back to another video. It's another tutorial. Um, last time you saw me build the 777, this is the Airbus A380. So, not going to waste time, so get straight into it. I'm not going to bother doing cards because just makes it so much more stressful, I think. But anyway, we can get started on layer number one. So, just come to the front of your aircraft where you're going to put it. Um, this does use the IRT pack by the way, so if you don't have that I might leave the link in the description, I might not, I'm not sure. Just place the black wall, and it'll go back 35 blocks in total. And it's to back gear. So just place them out in this sort of formation. So I can just do that, you should be able to copy that very easy. I'm going to show you how to build one side of the aircraft, but not the other half. So that's what you should now have. So we can now start the next layer. So if I just come over here. Oh, yeah. I forgot I had to reset it. <laughs> Good thing I put these red blocks here. Anyway, we can start the next layer. I did say this is the first reason. But anyway, just gonna add cobblestone wall on top. Then that's the upside down stair. Cobblestone wall, regular stair, same on this side. And let me just put the other wheel back in. That's what the other one should look like, so the exact same. We also add never brick slabs on top of all the all the things. We're actually I know we've only just started but we are flying through this. Now we're going to get to work on the base, base of the aircraft, but don't worry about this for now, so we can come down to that in a bit. So you just come to the front of the aircraft and go forward by two slabs, and in the middle you want to go 19 slabs back. Do the same on the outside, but it's 20 because it's overlapping there. Also, just place a black wall there and another, co another cobblestone wall. Come back at the end of the 19, like you've got here, you just want to place stairs facing forward going across the middle with, with a solid block behind it. Go to the outside of the last slab, place two. And a stair, and then let me find out how many slabs. Twelve slabs. These are both full blocks, so you add full blocks and a cobblestone wall, and then just simply four slabs, and then just on this, just go all the way to there with wall. And on the inside of it, it's just three across fifth stairs. Now what you can do from that stair there, you want to go back 17 on the outside and on the inside it's 18. So that's very nice and simple. We'll come down to the engines in a bit, so just ignore all of this for now. Don't forget if I'm going too fast, you can just slow it down. So I might as well just fix that back up.
Okay, first proper layer. Once again, we can ignore the whole wing part because that isn't necessary. So I can actually probably just do. Just get rid of all of that. So you want to come to the first slabs at the front, just place two blocks going forward and a slab. Slab there. And then you want to go back 18 blocks, two slabs out to the side, five blocks, slab, stair, that uh, goes back 15, stair, slab, four stair, four blocks, sorry, two slabs, and then 16 wool, three and then two just to round it off. And of course just fill that in there. We're actually going really quickly. I reckon we could get this done really quickly. So anyway, we can get to work on the next layer. So you go to that slab, place a block on top, go back for box slab, and then you want to go back 17. And then you just simply want to place 10 slabs of a stair on the last block there. Then you want to go back 21 blocks with a stair behind it, and then slabs going back for 17 and 19 blocks behind that, 2 slabs, 4 blocks, 2 to round it off, add blocks in the middle there. This is very quick, so I think we're already onto the door level, so... Keep forgetting, I need to... Yeah. So, so just ignore all the wing for now, because that's not necessary, because we'll come back down to that. So place a slab on top, with a block going back, slab to the side, two blocks. And then simply just put four blocks of quartz or cobblestone, depends what you're doing this in. If you're using aero team, it's quartz. If you're not using aero team, use cobblestone. And then one more wall after it. Slab, and then... You want to go back 10 blocks, door, 12 blocks, door, 11 blocks in the door, and then 13 blocks, a door, 2 wool, 1 slab, 4 wool, 3 wool, 1 slab, 2 wool, cobblestone slab. So that's for the bottom of the APU. So I can do undo. We're already on windows. Well, bottom there is anyway. Let's go over the whole thing. Okay. So go to that block, place a slab going up, two cobble brick, two um, stone brick slabs going back with a stair. Two white slabs to the either side, then just a block with a slab to the outside side. Two blocks, door with a button. All the doors now have buttons in this layer. A block and all backwards, upside down stairs. So that 10, door. So you just want to fill this in. 12, 11, and finally 13. Three blocks. Two blocks stair, five blocks, one block cobblestone. Simple. If I'm going too fast, just what you can do is you can slow down it on you can slow it down on YouTube. Ok, 
Okay. Place slab, block, slab, three blocks, slab there. Finish the door, block, slab, and then just want to go all the way. So on, um, just like you have done in the last layers. Stair, three blocks inside, one slab, slab, two blocks, stair, slab, slab, three blocks in the middle, and two stair slabs. I've got a really bad mouth at the moment, so if I'm talking weird, that's why. Okay, we're going to start on the upper deck now. So it's slab, stair, block, slab, stair, three blocks, slab, stair, three blocks, and then these are all normal backwards facing for nine. Block with a button, 16 backward facing, block with a button, 7 block with a button, so that's 7 windows below, then a block with a button, and then 3, then 7 wall, of course, what you're using, then stair, slab, 2 blocks, stair, slab, slab, then 1, 2, 3 blocks. Stair slab. Very easy to do. I'm actually getting through this really quickly for some reason. So it's actually the last layer of the fuselage already, so just to show you how quickly we're going through this. So it's slab stair. Slab, then it's just a three by whatever it is. So then it's a three by forty seven stair slab slab, and from the inside of that stair, go back eight so you're above that stair. So now we can do the horizontal stabilizer. One second, let me quickly disregard that. So anyway, we can start on the vertical stabiliser, so you're, you're currently here, place another block on top of it, go out and go up 4, go out a slab, go up 3, out a slab, out up 1, out 1, place 2 blocks, then out 1, place 2 blocks of a slab on top, go 4 by 2 more slabs, go down and out a block, out a slab, and then it's just staircasing all the way down. And then on the last block is its actual block and two stairs, just fill that in, that's the horizontal stabiliser. Okay, I'll cut through the wings because it makes it easier for me. Okay, for the wing, all I'm literally going to do is I'm going to go layer by layer, just showing you how to do it. So I'm just going to lay out this little grid just so I know where I'm going from. But I will quickly show you how to make so I'll come down to the engines where it gets down to it. So for the actually I need to need to get the other wing because this one's got the altered version. Let me just run on over to the actual one that I used. Come back. Just paste that in. And then just do this. So I'm just doing this to make it easier for you guys to do the wing, because I know I didn't really show it off in the triple seven. And this is definitely a more harder wing, so it just makes sense to do it like this. So 
So this is what it is, it's two blocks. So you just go to there. It's just not, I got a bit of the large just so you can see where it is. So it's two blocks down with a slab. And you just want to place nine slabs in the bottom. Three smooth stone. Six stone brick. Two stone brick slab. Then, then um, underneath for about 13 smooth stone with a smooth stone thing thing. Yeah. Okay, so next layer is just two blocks. So it's once again just keeping that pattern going, except it's only one stone brick slab. But it's got a stone slab at the back. And then yeah, you just gotta do smooth stone for twelve and then another one of them. So it's a very easy layer that one. So next layer it's just two again, keeping that pattern going, except that there's no no slab, it's stone brick slab, and you can actually make that like that. So I'll probably just stand here so you can see it, it's really easy. Okay, so you're actually going up a block. So just the top block here, so you want to go back with that nine, but the second to last is going to be a stone brick step full block. I can literally just show you this again, it's that simple. That's what it looks like from behind, the side. So yeah, very nice and easy. We are zooming. I had the first flap chat fairy, so you could go up a slab. Then you're gonna place how many is that? Nine stone brick. Well nine stone slabs with this on the top. And then that's what it looks like from behind, the flap chat fairy. That's a brick slab by the way. That's what it looks like from here. Top. The front. And the side. You can I can actually just show you it and you'll be able to build it, it's really easy. So we can actually get onto the next bit. So upper upper block. And you just want to go back three top slabs and three full stone brick slabs or blocks. Two stone brick slabs, and then once again, I can literally just show you it and you'll be able to get it. So that's what I'm going to keep on doing. This is what it looks like from the side and back, and the side and the top. So just literally it's pretty much is that the layer we've just done? No, it's not. It's another one of them. Once again I can literally just show you when you can build it. It's one of those no easy ones. On the top. So we'll go for a side angle here. The bottom actually. This is what they all look like from the bottom by the way, in case you haven't quite caught onto that. So those slabs they go back to just above the first wheel. Then you got other slabs. Next there you're going up a block. Then it goes back to five stone bricks, two stone slabs and down a slab. So very easy. Okay, it's literally pretty much the exact same. Two blocks, 
then it's six stone bricks, one slab, and then that's an iron trap door there by the way, so just bear that in mind. That's what it looks like for that next flat crack fairy. Very simple. It's what the wing should now look like from the top. So just top slabs now. Go back to one stone brick slab, four stone bricks, stone block, can you put a block in there? Yeah, and stone slab. Very easy. The start of the engine then. So it's another one of them. You can literally just do the exact same, I think. Yeah, it literally is the exact same, just two blocks and one slab. So you can come down here below this. You want to place a stair like that. Two stairs going forward. Stone brick slab, stone brick block, stone slab. Three wall in the middle. Another stair like that, and then just two going forward. It is such an easy lay of that. But that's what it looks like from the side and the top. Arguably this way might be slightly longer, but you know, it works. So it's three wool on the bottom, three on the top, stone brick stair upside down, top, black wool button, stone button to be exact, iron trap door, two stone slabs, cobble brick, with cobble stone, then cobble wool with slabs on top and bottom. Come to here, and literally I can show you when you can build it. It's so easy, and it's literally the exact same as that on the other side. So I don't have to show you how to do that. And it's the exact same flat engine as well. So literally the exact same layer, pretty much. That two, that four, two, one, two, 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 one brick, boom. Side angle. Top angle. We are zooming. I can literally just show you it from now on, I think. So we're, we're through the hard part of down there. So, literally, yeah, just do that. Literally again I'll just show you how to build it. just show you when you can build it. Top view side bottom back. There you go. Next one. Two steps. I'm literally just show you. So I think we've just done that. I can't remember, but I'll just show you both. So that's what they both look like on the top, in case, yeah, I think we were on there. So, that's what they look like on top. The bottom. And the side. So I'm, I'm losing at this point. I don't know. Got this now. Once again, I can actually just show you it. You can build it. Very simple. You can tell I want to get through this as quick as I can. Just do the exact same, I think it is pretty much.
Stay good. There you go. Build it. You can tell I'm just getting lazy now at this point. Top view. Bottom view. Just do the whole engine again here. But the pylon's different, so just don't worry about that for now. Side. And the bottom. I think this is actually the last flat track fairing, here it is. So the engine again, the pylon just connects straight onto the wing this time, not like that one. So it's that, then we go back four stone slabs, three, two, like that, and then one. So very simple, it's the exact same engine, so. Literally, I can show you what you can build it. So you probably can't see it through your chat. You've probably had long enough to see it. So. There it is. Build. You will have to pause this, by the way, so I'm going incredibly quick. There it is, once again, just build it. And there it is, build it. It's not hard now at this point. Very nice and simple still. There you go. And the last straight now, pretty much. There you go. And that's what it, that's what it should look like for you at the moment. Side view, obviously. We need to see at this point. There you go. There you go, last, pretty much in the last few layers now. Illegal. Very simple. There you go. I really shouldn't have to show you anymore. It's so easy. And that's the actual wing, this is the last layer of the wing I think, so. Oh, I've got one more layer. No, and it's literally just free. And that's the wingtip fence. And that is it for the wing, so. Yes, congratulations. You should have that now. Now for the horizontal stabilizer, show you the outline. I should probably just show you it. That's it from the top. The side. It does start a bit low. If I could change anything now, I would make it go up. But and that's the button. Now over here at the top, and there you go, you should have a Airbus E380 in your world now. Hope you enjoyed, see you in the next video. Goodbye.